welcome back to my video. Um, today the video that I'm going to be doing is um, doing review. I'm going to do a review on Kylie Cosmetics. Um, I got two of her lip kits. I got um, the Kylie Coco K and the Candy K. So overall, a lot of you guys have you know been asking how long does it take for shipping. Shipping took um, took three days for them to process my order, and it took another three days for shipping. So it took like a week to get them, which I thought would be more, um, which is pretty fast to me because I, you know, it's Kylie and she gets high demand, so I didn't think they were going to get them that fast. So now I'm going to um, start with Candy K and I'm going to actually show you guys how it looks on my lips. So I don't have anything on my lips. I haven't even applied anything, nothing, not even a moisturizer for my lips or lip balm, nothing. So this is how it looks when you take it out of the box. It just says Kylie matte liquid lipstick and that's the design and then this is how the lip liner looks so the first thing I'm going to start doing is lining my lips um, I'm using this tart mirror tart lip mirror just to see good because I can't see on the other mirror and I'm just lining them the tip is really easy to line like you just literally like place it on your lip and it's like super easy to line. So I line my, my bottom one, I'm gonna line my top. And I'm just going to fill my whole lip in. So now that's how my, my lip looks. Now I'm just going to go in with the liquid lipstick. And this liquid lipstick reminds me of... It reminds me of the Milani liquid lipsticks. It has the same smell, like that, like, like coconutty, like sweet candy smell to it. Okay guys, so that's how this color looks. Um, this is a really cute nude, I love this color. It's like a pink, it's um beautiful color. Um, so a lot of you guys are gonna ask about how it feels on my lips. It doesn't feel drying. It doesn't feel like I applied something that, you know, sometimes you apply liquid lipstick and it feels super duper dry. It doesn't, it feels moist. And it feels really beautiful. I'm so glad it comes with the lip liner. And a lot of you guys are gonna say, is it worth buying it? I don't know. Um, I don't know what's worth it to you guys because if you're a beauty lover, everything is worth it to you. Like, you know, the Tartlet palette, for example, costs like 50 bucks. It might be expensive, but it's worth it to you to collect it and have it in your makeup collection. I hadn't bought these because I've heard very mixed reviews on her shipping and a lot of her stuff. So I was kind of like, and then a lot of girls were like, oh, you know, it's, it's the same as Colourpop formula. 
And to me, um, this formula I feel is a little less strong than the ColourPop one. I'm a, I love ColourPop and you know, I have a whole bunch. I have like 30 liquid lipsticks, but their formula varies. Some formula will be like creamier and some will be really dry and patchy. Man, this one is just really beautiful. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take this off and now we're gonna go do Coco K. So I'm just gonna show it to you guys a little closer. This is how it looks. And um, I know today is not my really best makeup day. I decided to do like a glitter cut crease and it's my first time ever doing it. So I don't think I did the best. I didn't do the worst, um, but you know, I'm still practicing. Anyways, I'll be back in a bit guys. So I'm going to start using the liner for the Coco K. This liner is like really, really light. It's like almost my skin tone. Of, not the skin tone, but the color of my lips, kind of. So it doesn't show up as much. And there, I finished lining it, and I'm just gonna get the the same the Coco K um, liquid lipstick. So that's how this color looks. This color is more of um like light pink. The other one's more of a darker pink. When I swatched them on my hand, they look super similar. And I was like, oh, that sucks. They're super similar shades. I should have got something different. But I'm glad I got both of these because this one is like more of a light, lighter pink, and the other one's more of a darker, like nude pink. So overall i am satisfied with my purchase i'm happy i went ahead and purchased these i am going to purchase more and thanks to god i don't have any trouble with kylie cosmetics and um i didn't have any trouble with shipping i didn't have any trouble with my product you know not being how it's supposed to and i don't know like a lot of people are you know saying she doesn't put enough product in here and i'm looking inside i don't know um i don't know this that's how it's supposed to be or not um so that's just um that's just you know i do have like product here because some people said they weren't even getting any product on their wand so maybe that's just you know how she how she does does it i'm not sure i'm not really like you know i don't know how people you know distribute their makeup but to me the overall um product is good i like how it turned out on my lips um my lips are a little chapped today so it would have been better if i would have went ahead and exfoliated them and all that i just didn't do that because i didn't have enough time but i would recommend you guys to do that and thank you guys please remember to like to subscribe to comment and thank you all for watching my videos bye